homes damaged from that fire as those embers spread quickly. And this is video that we captured yesterday. You can see people taking out their garden hoses, trying to wet down their roofs mm -hmm. as some of the homes are burning right next door. Yeah, one of the biggest problems is that many of those homes in that area have wood shingles. And 41 Action News reporter Lisa Benson now joins us live. And Lisa, yesterday's wind plus those wood shingles really fueled this thing. That is right. Uh, Pauletta Ashby tells us a firefighter told her to evacuate her home because her roof, which is wooden, is on fire. Unlike the other houses in her cul-de-sac, which have no roof damage. It didn't take long for it to just go up like a match. From 113th and Neiman, you can see what's left of Pauletta Ashby's wood shake roof. My house was the only house in this cul-de-sac that had a wood shingle roof. My house is the only house to burn. Ashby's home is one of 22 damaged in Monday's apartment complex fire. The wind scattered embers throughout the College Park Estate 2 subdivision. Her pictures reveal how the flames consumed her wooden rooftop. The older those wood shakes, the more brittle they are, which means they're getting, the more flammable they are. These things, after about 10 years, start to weather, start to get brittle. Um, become extreme fire hazards as we know. Matt George is with RJM Roofing. He says wood shake shingles are expensive to replace and are aesthetically more pleasing to some, but he typically advises against them because composite materials add more protection. These are not going to catch fire like a like a wood shake shingle at all. Less than half of the probability of going up in flames. A reality Ashby learned the hard way. She believes her home will be declared a total loss, but somehow she remains grateful. I am uh, grateful and thankful to be alive because I could have been in their sleep, you know, and not even realized that the place was on fire. So, and then, you know, all of that is stuff. It can be replaced. Now, Ashby says she was aware of the weaknesses of her wooden roof and she was planning on replacing it this summer. Live in Overland Park, Lisa Benson, 41 Action News. Wow.